Well, we now know that Disney is going to name their streaming service Disney Play, and they have some pretty high goals that they're going to be shooting for. So the Disney upcoming service, Disney Play, as it was officially uh, kind of just out there recently, um, you know, is going to be moving forward in 2019. I've already talked about the fact of how that's going to be their biggest focus of the year. The market for TV is ever changing. It's shifting. You know, 15 years ago, you had to get the triple bundles and all that and oh, include the phone and, you know, oh, include the fast Internet. And at the time, it was, you know, basic you know, cable speeds that have since increased due to the invention of high definition and all that becoming more mainstream. And cell phones certainly have evolved, so nobody needs, you know, like a landline phone. I don't remember the last time I even used a landline phone, right? And then TV is this completely different thing now where I cut the cord, you know? I use Sling TV for 20 bucks a month. I get like 40 channels. That's how I watch my wrestling. I got a WWE Network for pay-per-views. And I got Hulu and Netflix for my, you know, online services to watch stuff. And then I have Crunchyroll to watch mech anime. So that's really it, right? And Disney is apparently going to be putting a lot of emphasis on the streaming service where they've said it's, you know, their main goal for 2019. When the service kicks off, they're going to have a lot of properties from live action and, uh, you know, TV series to movies that they're producing on high budgets because they want to drive content. Now, a lot of people are looking at this and going, well, what exactly is the idea there, right? And the idea is that they want to be an all-in-one hub, and that's kind of what everybody wants, right? And they're certainly not going to be because they have, you know, eight years to catch up to Netflix and a few years to catch up to Hulu, but it's a pretty good goal. And putting something like a Star Wars and a Marvel series and a few movies out there that are pretty high budget is definitely going to be a start. So it looks like Disney's 2019 between Avengers 4, the new start to the MTU, the ending to the MCU. Did I say MTU? Maybe I did. Whatever. Anyway, yeah, you get what I'm saying. Disney 2019. It's going to be big. And I'm just going to keep waiting for a solo too. Maybe it could be a streaming movie. Yeah, that'd be great. That'd be great.